eternal God, creator God, mother and father of us all. We come humbly to you this morning with our praise, with our thanks, and with our petitions. We thank you for all that we behold and all that is beyond our ability to behold, for you are the creator and all that you created is good. We thank you for this communion of your people that is the Park Avenue Christian Church. We are very aware of the preciousness of the ability and the freedom to be in worship together in your presence once again. But we are mindful of those who are not able to be with us this morning because of health limitations. And we lift them in prayer to you and ask for their healing. We also lift today Henry, the cat, who is suffering terminal illness. Please receive Henry as well. But as we relish the beauty of today's gathering, we are yet mindful that all is not right with the world. We are mindful of those who are mourning the loss of loved ones, and we lift them. We especially lift Stephanie Wilson in the loss of her aunt. We also lift the families of Terrence Crutcher in Tulsa and Keith Scott in Charlotte. God, you have loved us without ceasing and have bid us to do the same. Yet violence seems to be the order of the day throughout the world. Violence in the form of poverty is all around us in its many manifestations. Hunger, joblessness, poor or no health care, homelessness, institutional racism, sexism, religious persecution, closed political borders, rejection because of sexual orientation or sexual identification. Violence is in the form of rape and sex trafficking and labor or an immigration trafficking. God, we ask that if it is your will to remove the cups of violence from those who experience it each and every day. We plead as did the prophet Isaiah, oh, that you would rip open the heavens and descend to shock your enemies into facing you, make the nation shake in their boots. We pray that one day through you, by whatever name you are called throughout the world, that this world will know love and peace that passeth all understanding. Lord, we ask that you strengthen us, undergird us so that when we leave this sanctuary, we may be instruments of peace, seeking to rid this nation and this world of violence and injustice, seeking to spread the love of Jesus the Christ, in whose name we pray, world without end. Amen. 